What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have an early look at the new 2223 Bowman U Chrome. Been waiting for this one for a while. Very, very excited. Inception was so much fun and now we have Chrome. So if you guys like this, you want to see more early reviews and stuff like that, like, subscribe, free to you guys, helps us do a lot more like this. Big thank you to Tops for allowing me to review this early for you guys. This releases tomorrow at the time of recording, so I wanted to preview it so you guys can see what the set's all about. And uh, yeah, so thanks to Tops and thanks to you guys as always for uh, watching the vids, all the support. Here's the information for this product. So the price is about 200, give or take you know, 10, 20 bucks. And then here is uh, the kind of per box contents. So look for four cards in every pack, 24 packs per box, 12 box cases. In every single box, and there's a lot of stuff here. So here we go. Look for two autographs. There's two 09 uh, Bowman inserts. There's three Skyscraper inserts. There's two Bowman Invicta inserts, one Shimmer Refractor, two colored parallels or image variations, and then four refractors. So not too much. And then here are the kind of parallel autographs. And also these are licensed, uh, fully licensed for the collegiate guys. There's international prospects and G-leaguers. So once again, Wemby is in here. There's Caitlin Clark, Scoot, Brandon Miller. And I believe Wemby has an on-card autograph from the images we've seen. So parallels. Don't think there's anything on the box, right? No. Yeah, no. So. Here we go. Parallels. There's Super Fractor 1 of 1. There's Red to 5, Orange to 25, Gold to 50, and many more. Then look for inserts. There's Big Kahuna, which is like the case hit. A bunch of other common ones I mentioned earlier, the per box contents, and the autographs. There's Chrome Prospects, which, once again, Wemby, I think, is on card from the mock ups I've seen. Caitlin Clark is a sticker, and I think so is Brandon Miller, and I imagine Scoop probably is too. Unless, who knows? Maybe we're surprised. But uh, look for insert autographs and a bunch of others. I believe, looking at the checklist, Wemby has a extended base card, so not in the regular set, and it should be pretty rare. So let's crack these boxes, let's see what's going on, and let's hopefully pull something very nice. We have two here for our review, and let's hope for Wemby. A lot of good players to chase in this stuff. So we did Inception. That was absolutely amazing, actually, now I think about it. We pulled two total Wembys. We did a Wemby chase. Should we do that with this product? What do you guys think? It might be a little too long. That last one took us forever. And yeah, it might be too long. I don't know. 24 packs in a box? It'd be hours, possibly. Or maybe it's one minute. Who knows? Take the packs out just because we have two large boxes on here. And we did the Inception review. So we pulled some Wemby's and... We also pulled some Brandon Miller, things like that. So here we go. Let's see some uh, top names. This is a lot of the upcoming guys. Here we go. Pack number one. Let's see the cards. There we go. So Bowman Baseball. The first Bowman is huge and same design as the baseball one. So that's big here. Let's see if we can get an autograph. Can we get anything here? We can. All right, here we go. If you guys like these videos, once again, want to see more, drop a like and sub. It's free and helps us do a lot of stuff here. Okay, position, point guard. Let's just see it. Kiki Rice. All right, I'll take that. There we go. There's the base one. There's the backs of the cards. Different stuff there. Cool. Sticker auto. But first, Bowman. It is collegiate. So I'm curious how, I guess, the desirability pans out in the long term because first Bowman is one of the biggest cards in cards. But then again, basketball and football often don't love collegiate. Now Wemby is my college one exactly. There's Mikey and hey, maybe the first pick in next year's NBA draft. So that could be big. His first is in here. No licensing there, but he's a high schooler. Next one up. We also have an impeccable basketball giveaway. You haven't seen our review on that one. Pulled some monsters and giving a bunch of way to you guys. So you want to enter, you can uh, do it by liking, subbing, and then following me on my whatnot page and showing our live stream when it's time and we'll give everything away. There's a link down below in the description. So there's the 09 MJ Rice. All right. I love that first logo. I'm a big sucker for the first logo. Not ashamed. I love it. Absolutely love it. I do collect a lot of baseball, and there's an orange. And love the first. This is Mr. Mr. D. I'll be collecting him. And he'll be a high pick as well. So love that. 
All right. Please be auto. Okay. Ooh, Jerry McCain. That is very interesting. To 25, 13 to 25. He won't be in this draft. He'll be in the next draft, I believe. I think he's Duke. He's going to Duke. So that could be very big. I don't see a first logo, so maybe he had a Bowman card before. That could be something of high note. A lot of these are the waiting game. So we have the current class. They haven't played yet, of course, so waiting there. But with uh, Matas, with uh, McCain there, playing the waiting game. And we'll see how they do. And they're skyscraping when they get to the NBA, but high level prospects. So I like that a lot. The orange, it's hobby exclusive. It's beautiful. So love seeing these oranges. And there we are. Some more base. And there's another 09. Bailey. Next pack up. Also, I must say, these packs open beautifully. Beautifully. If you have a thicker card like this, which is the Invicta, you'll have three cards. All right. And put that there. There's the insert. We've seen that before in other Bowmans. This is not the first Bowman you set, but it is the first time it's licensed for basketball, at least in recent memory. Yeah, I think so. So last year's wasn't licensed. This year's is. There we go. Another one. That should be our two per box. And between this and the Bowman U, I think there maybe will be some more. It's going to be interesting to see. Which companies have which athletes? There's a little fractor there. And do check the codes in the back, probably for the variations that will number down there if it differs. Could be. Maybe it says somewhere else. I don't know where, but it might. And uh, yeah, it'll be interesting because there's been some rumors about which athletes are with which companies. Obviously, the licensing being shifting. It's very interesting. Some of the QBs with football, that's something to watch. And Wemby, for example, who knows? Who knows? So, interesting times for the hobby. We will see where things go, hopefully in a good direction. But so far, I'm loving the new sets. And another, oh, here's another good first. Whitmore, put them there. So, I will be watching closely to see how these cards do, I guess, in the long term. Being at... Yes, it's their first, but it is collegiate, but it is their first. I guess if you're not a big baseball guy, the first doesn't mean too much to you, but another good one. Walker should go high in the draft. Hensel Emanuel, cool to see him. There we go. But yeah, time will tell. Let's continue on. Pull their autos, but no numbereds from the base. I'd love to see that, uh, that Wemby extended base now there were some issues I think it was like the Julio for example in Topps Chrome where there were some issues with that so hopefully we that's it that's it what do we ask I mentioned it okay that's it now I don't know if that's an error or something like that this is this is really interesting a few things here with this card that's the Victor Women Yama card that's his first First card, right? There's no card that people could have had yet because his Bowman Inception was a redemption. So this is the first Wembenyama card. Has the first logo, but it's faded. I wonder, is that intentional or is that an error? Are they all like that? We will see very soon. The release date is tomorrow. Whether or not this is an error, which would be kind of cool, or if they're all like that and they all had a kind of a print error. We will find out, but this is a very rare card. Very rare card. Definitely not easy to pull. And that is awesome. We got one. Wembenyama. So his autograph will look just like this. Probably not faded out like that. I've seen his autograph from those pictures they provided. And imagine a sticker, or not a sticker, but like a kind of auto box. We'll wait it out and it says his autograph. So that is Wembenyama. The first Wembenyama card. Wow. There we are. There we are. That is sick. So we can pull an auto now. Maybe we see a we see a Clark Scoot or Miller. That would 
make the break. I can't complain. We pulled the Wemby. And I'm very curious. Like, all the pictures here are colored in full. Is that just an error? Or are they all like that? I kind of want it, for my own sake, to be a... Uh, that's just be an error. That'd be super cool. But we will find out. So that's his extended base card. So there's the base set, which I think is 100 subjects. And then there's like a 101, which is just Victor Wembanyama. Wow. I cannot believe we did it. That is a very rare card. All right. There's Mr. Mr. Big D. And he's actually a baller too, which is what I love. I'm hoping he goes to the Magic, the Hornets. Where are you guys hoping he goes? I love him. And I will be collecting. I'll be there no matter what. All right. Let's continue on. Wow. The Wemby. I want people to get the Wemby. That is crazy. We have Boston. That's a nice one. We have another insert. Put her first right there. Oh, man. All right. So we'll see. I'll be anxiously waiting to see another one pop up. I know they're rare. And those are big. His autographs, if it's anything like Bowman Inception, not easy to pull. And they were redemptions. I don't know if he's redemption here, but we do know he's at least, I think, signed the cards. So if he's a redemption, and this does apply for Inception, I'd imagine they'd come in hopefully soon because he has been doing, we well, you know, at least some signing. So hopefully those redemptions come in soon rather than later. All right, the timing when we got that was crazy. I'm in disbelief. Wemby. All right. Now all I gotta do is uh, meet him and have him sign it there. And that'd be a cool card for the uh, collection. Wow. This set's fun. And I historically don't love collegiate cards that much, but you know, mm, oh, for me. Once I saw that first, and the Wemby not being necessarily college, because he's not in college. So, the prospect cards. I definitely warmed up on those recently with a lot of the sets coming out. And it's been nice to see. All right. Oh, baby. Last uh, two packs. We have two boxes of this. This is a good box. All right. Uh huh. And. Here's our shimmer. There we go. Cool. Nice. We'll put that right there. Last pack. And again, to box two. All right. Last pack from box one. Brandon Miller. Nick Smith. He'll go here. And that's box one. And oh, baby. Was it a very exciting and good box. We'll put this here. Here's box two. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. And get the wrapping off. Man, I'm sweating. Can we go two for two? Oh, sorry, base cards. I apologize. I can't even reach them, so they'll chill there for a minute. And you'll get a lot of those. If someone pans out, you have their first. So we will see. And there we are. I'm literally trembling right now. Okay. Here's a uh, box number two. Wow, wow, wow. All right, box two. What you got for us? Cool. Yeah, sorry, base cards. I don't want to knock this stack over by reaching for them. It's taller than it looks. It looks kind of flat in the camera. It's actually much taller than that. All right, here we go. So box two, vote for the winner after. Maybe we get Wemby Auto. Put that. We'll put these guys here. And one thing important to mention is these, I made a big order for this product and they came in and I got permission to open it. They did not send me, you know, these two as some loaded boxes. So I just pulled these from the cases I ordered and got permission from Tops to preview it for you guys. So sure, some people are wondering, good old influencer box, MJ Rice to $3.99. Here we are. And while they've never existed here, I can't speak for anywhere else, but yeah, if that ever happens, I'll 
be quick to mention something, as I have in the past. Uh huh. All right. Put this here. Next one. Man, this product's fun. Very, very fun. Mr. Grady. Owen Grady. All right. Next pack. All the autos. I want a Wemby. We pulled the Wemby, but it was a redemption. And that's what really, you know, put a little, all right, on the pole, as cool as it was. But to finally see him on the card in the packs, that's awesome. I'm really hoping his autographs here are also live, like that, that base art, which of course will be live. There we are. Now question, are the parallels? That I don't know. I don't know. We will find out soon. So maybe there are, maybe there aren't. In that case, I have the base one. I'll still take it. I know that's a very rare card, but we will get more information soon. Chris Murray, we've seen him before. And next pack, no autos yet. Come on, ink. Oh, purple. Not auto. Mints. And there we are. Number two, three ninety-nine. I like. My favorite color. And next pack. So overall, the big ones you're looking for. At least four packs in a box with those numbered and autos. Well, Nick Smith and another Shibway. And then the case hit possibly. So the refractors won't be anything too crazy. They're nice. Well, something inserts. You get a lot of those. The big kahuna is the one, once again, that you're looking for. Hey, there's Caitlin Clark. There we go. Caitlin Clark's Bowman card. Got a lot of lint on it. Uh, that comes off. Just went from the pack, seems. But there's her first uh, Bowman. What do you guys think? Her Inception base was doing numbers. Serious numbers. There we go. We had a bunch given away recently. There's Caitlin Clark. Maybe we can see, uh, I don't know, Scoot. We saw Miller already. Not yet, though. We're getting uh, pretty deep into that stack. No autos yet. All right, no problem. There's a little Mikey. And you know what? That stack is taller in... The camera doesn't do it justice. That is actually taller than this camera makes it look. Here's a green. And so, there's a card in this product. Victor Wamiyama signed the green. Signed his name and said the first card I ever signed on it. Inscribed it. It's a green parallel. So, a green Wemby. Oh boy. Come on. Give us green, right? A little green action. Three, two, one. Okay, so it's not, it's not Wemby, but... This would be the parallel to 99 that we'd be looking for. Ayana Patterson. Cool. Give it a sleeve. There we are. Well, first Bowman auto and good to see some ink and not get shorted. Next pack. Walker, manual, and put these guys here. All right. Continue on. Now the big kahuna. I have pulled that. Last year we opened this product. I think it was last year. And maybe two years ago. I'm not sure. But we pulled the Chet, the case hit, and the big auto. So this product has been good to me. All right, next one. Come on, auto. Oh, no. Never mind. False alarm. Derek Lively. We continue on. Can I see a thick card? So the autographs from Tops, all the chrome ones, are slightly thicker. I'll try to point it out if we see it. But you'll be able to tell autograph or numbered card pretty easily. If I can find one to show you guys. Should have one more. And then we can take a nice long look at that 1B card and see what's up. Yeah, so I didn't notice it. I took a quick peek. That one is a little bit thicker. See that? 
I don't know if you can notice. A little bit thicker. Easier to notice in, in person. Jalen Wilson. Okay. There we are. And last five packs. I think we still need a number, probably. I think so. Can we get anything? Anthony Black. Another upcoming top pick. Bailey. Another insert. Put these guys here. And last three. So far, box one, safe to say, has the advantage by a lot. And is going to keep that advantage for now. Brandon Miller. Last two. I think we need a numbered. Also, I'm forgetting one. You got the purple, right? And then... Hmm, maybe not. Boston. Mystery. Caleb Love. Last pack. I might just be forgetting one. I think a card fell somewhere. I don't know where. Oh, is it this, this one? Yeah, these ones fell. These do have a little bit of a bend. Chrome cards get those very quickly. And they'll spin around and fall very easily. Last pack. Maybe we did get it. All right. Walker. There we are. Box two wasn't the best. Thankfully, box one was uh, pretty close to the best. So here's a recap of two. Then we'll recap one. What are your thoughts on the product? So overall, I am definitely a fan of what I'm seeing here. There's our autographs. Box two. Hey, got a Caitlin Clark. Uh, you know what? There we go. One and two. My bad, my bad. It's on me. There's the... First we got some of the better ones. Some accidentally made it in the stack, with all due respect. And there we go. And then the the box. Box one. I think he's the winner. You guys let me know. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Ooh, Grady. Got Trace. Jackson Davis. Victor Wembenyama. That is... There's so many questions I have right now, which will be answered soon, hopefully, but I'm so anxious to know. Kiki Rice, Brandon Miller, uh, that should be it. There we go. Yep. Bazellus, that could be something big there. So, overall, I'll grab these four. Big success. Got the Wemby. This is a very rare card. Don't know how rare, but I know it's a very rare card, and additionally... It should be his first card, kind of pack fold card here, because his Inception one was a redemption. So this is big time. Are they all like this? I don't know. Are there parallels? I don't know. Um, yeah, very exciting. Got an orange. Jerry McCain could be big years from now. Then uh, got a Grady and Caitlin Clark. So there you go. Wemby, you got to close it for us. And that does it for this review. What do you guys think of the product? Comment down below. Overall, kind of tough to rate something like this. Not much to compare it to, but I do like it. I think it's, I'll kind of give like a, a verbal rating, kind of like, I'd say above average set for sure. Maybe in that like low sevens, but tough to compare it to really anything because it's different from what we have currently on the market. But yeah, overall, I do like it. And um, man, Wemby, we got one. Please, please be an error. That'd be so cool. I'm a sucker for error cards. So there we go. Those are for this one, guys. Thank you always for watching. If you get some for yourself, wish you guys the best of luck. Let me know what you pull. Comment back to this video. Comment down below. And uh, yeah, I'll see some Wemby comments. So those are for this one, guys. Thank you always for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Till next time, I'll see you later.